Hello, this is a quick instructional on how to utilize the stack ranking form for your evaluations and merit increases for the year. When you first open the file, select Enable Macros and that way it will be able to perform the sort function for you. Alright, at this point we'll enter the names just as we read them right out of API. Don't be concerned at this point for the sort order because the sheet will actually do that for us once we, pl once we place the rankings in. Get your annual rates out of API and you can enter them as you put the name in or you can do them all at once after, such as I've done here. Either way will work just fine. Once we've got all the names and salaries in, I'm going to put 3% across the board to populate the formulas. And then you'll notice at the top in the gray box it gives you a 3%, which is our budget. And it also gives you a dollar amount in the gray box, which is based on the 3%, your total dollar amounts available for your budgeted pay increases. Now I'm going to start stack ranking my employees and I don't need to put a ton of thought into this right now because I can go back after and adjust as much as I need to. So I will just get a number by each of the employees and then once I hit this sort button you'll see that it sorts them from highest to lowest ranking. One being the highest ranking of course. Then as I look at it I may decide that Anthony actually should be between numbers 3 and 4 so I'm just going to put a 3.5 there and then sort it and you can see that it slid him up between 3 and 4 and then I might decide that Suzanne actually should be between 1 and 2 so I'm going to throw a 1.2 in there and rank her and sort it there. I may then decide that uh, Jose is actually after number 5 so I put him a 5.1 and resort it and it moved him down. So you can see that you can adjust your rankings without having to adjust all the numbers individually. You can just adjust the person you need to move and slide them between other numbers. Once I'm good with the sort, now I can start adjusting my percent increases. And you'll notice as I adjust these percentages, cell Q6 will start jumping around. And keep in mind we need to keep that at 3% or lower. So this will just help us to see what we can do and kind of adjust and tweak. If we go up on the higher ranked individuals, naturally we would need to reward less on the lower ranked individuals. You'll notice that number in Q6, as I adjust things around, I just keep an eye on that and making sure that I'm staying within my budget so I can kind of adjust percentages around. It looks like I've got a little more room so I could bump somebody up if I needed to. Adjust somebody up here if I needed to. And you can see that that put me a touch over, so I'm going to adjust somebody down right here, and it uh, looks like I've got it at 2.99.